Alright, next day, Sunday, October 13th, and I got, <laughs> just look, look at her, dressed up. Of course, being from Vietnam, it's, uh, it's the coldest it gets there, and the dead of winter is about 80 degrees, so I guess you can't be too shocked that she's dressed like, uh, like I'd be dressed in the coldest part of winter. But anyway, <laughs> got the dam all taken care of. Of course, I left it in place, but I had to do some more work to it water levels went down a little bit so I had to walk out where the water leaves over there and put a couple more bigger rocks in there that was fun just wearing frog legs uh, I was wondering if I was gonna fill a leg up but anyway I'm gonna take a walk up in here and show you something interesting now you see that big tree that's the oldest tree in this immediate area all these other trees are young trees. So I'm going to take a walk up in there and I'm going to show you something. Okay, so I've been calling this an old river channel, and I'm not too sure of that the more I think about it, because up there a ways it kind of terminates, like it just begins on its own with no explanation. Now I'm going to go up here, and I'll explain more once I get up here. Okay, so I was just right down there, shooting up there. Now up in here, you'll see mounds all over the place sometimes in a row over here there's a very distinct one I mean this whole area right here is mounded all the way up through I'll walk up here a little bit further now what I'm about to explain to you I had confirmed by a guy who has befriended one of the Vermont state geologists to the point of having access to his well I don't know what you'd call it uh, what he can see on the internet we can't access these things but geologists can now see that mound right there and this looks to be an old channel also but there again it kind of just begins with no explanation. These are old workings. All these mounds are old tailing piles. Right there along those trees. The trees are growing in them now. So back in the 1800s during the gold rush there was something going on here and it's not documented. At least not that we can find yet. Now this old channel, this is, which was also confirmed by my friend who has access to that stuff that we don't have access to. This is an ancient river channel right here. And Hung and I have sampled in here and have found gold. I mean, there's some monster boulders in here. Look at the size of that thing. That's big. This is where the trees bottled up, up above. 
during Irene but this does charge in really bad storms and in the spring when you get melt off and rain at the same time so this is one of my goals to get in here when it's charged and do some digging where I can get a setup with the three foot riverbed hog but look at these it's all these old workings there's that mound closer up over here all old tailing piles another one right behind it more up there they're everywhere pretty interesting thought I'd share that with you and for those of you who would love to get in here and find out where this is well <laughs> this is private property as I've said many times and it is watched it's off from a dead-end road and three of the neighbors on that road that I know of old-school backwoods Vermonters they uh, they keep an eye on this property and they'll shoot first and ask questions later so I, I don't think that'd be a good idea but anyway so I'm gonna head back down here and do some digging see if I can get me another cornflake today and a bunch of gold catch you in a bit All right, I don't know how many of you remember this but where this bedrock comes across there was a bunch of big boulders over in this point that went straight across here and this whole gravel bar boulder bar came to it and was the same level as that up there so I've dug all this out I've had you know Nick here digging Hung's dug in here with me so today she says it's turning into a swimming pool I said well actually I'm working towards an Olympic size swimming pool at this point I don't know if you can get any perspective of how much I've dug out of here from the video but it's quite a bit quite a bit and it's all been run through that hey dingus are you enjoying the leaves yet of course you're always pulling your capture tray and dunk 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 splash 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 and concentrating your concentrates at the end of the day so it's not a big deal but I don't do that generally but now I have to because every once in a while of course with it set here I haven't had any leaves go down the scoop and plug up any tubes but they're sure coming over the skid plate and getting caught on here but anyway so today yesterday I dug in here punched it back even further but the gravel bar was all the way up in here just the top of this rock was showing and only a tip of this one was showing this was all buried in filled in and I've dug in behind I'm working towards getting this one moved which I'm about to do because I'm pretty convinced that the pay streak is in this area so there there that those are all in my way gotta go that's gonna be fun all right back to work Huh? You can't move that one yet, huh? Not yet. So we've abandoned. Yeah. Hung was digging up in there and she was getting hardly anything. And so I said, well, you be helping me out if you come over here and start digging this end of this big boulder. Because I need to try to flop it that way. And she found another huge boulder in there. And after moving all this material, I finally decided to do a clean out and check my capture tray. It was only about I don't know 60 pieces or so so I said you know after moving all that yeah I got 60 pieces of gold but it's an awful lot of work for just 60 pieces I decided to test this clay so BJ I'm getting dirty buddy <laughs> so I've got her over here too and I got one nice chunky piece out of it but that's some nasty stuff. So we'll see what we can do.
checking the current. found center of the earth mining one time. Got to go. Hung can't see anymore, so <laughs> I can't either as far as the gold goes. So we took this quite away. Sorry I didn't show you the gold for the day. It wasn't uh, a stellar gold day, but we got gold. So coming back tomorrow again, Columbus Day, do some more. So see you then.